The moment you hear about the 2026 Tesla Model 2 and the incredible aluminum ion battery, you can feel something shift. What we are about to uncover is something that certain global competitors, especially in China, might prefer to keep hidden. Elon Musk has also made it clear that Tesla vehicles are not just electric cars, they are also the safest vehicles you can drive. Many people at Tesla, even those who work there, may not fully realize the safety statistics. This is not a matter of opinion, it is backed by hard facts. Statistically, Tesla is safer than anything else on the road. And battery safety, especially concerning fires and explosions, has always been one of the biggest fears surrounding electric vehicles. Today, we are going to unpack exactly how Tesla plans to fix that. But before we go further, welcome to Amp Drive. If you are passionate about Tesla and future technology, be sure to subscribe to Amp Drive so you never miss out on what comes next. Let us get into the real story now. Just imagine this. You bring your Tesla home, park it in your garage, plug it in to charge overnight, and fall asleep without any concern that something could go wrong while you are resting. For millions of homeowners, that sense of security has been taken away due to the frightening track record of lithium-ion battery fires. But Tesla's new aluminum-ion technology is not just about charging faster. It is about giving families back that lost peace of mind. Let us explain everything in detail. We begin with the dangerous situation many people are currently facing. The numbers are clear and concerning. In the year 2023 alone, there were 268 fires across the United States directly caused by lithium-ion batteries. The situation gets even worse when you zoom in. In 2022, in New York City alone, over 200 lithium-related fires were reported. Six people tragically lost their lives, and nearly 150 were injured. That was four times higher than the previous year. These numbers pushed cities like New York and San Francisco to restrict or even ban large lithium battery installations in homes. When firefighters are more nervous about a battery pack than they are about gasoline, you know something is seriously wrong. Now let us talk about Tesla's aluminum ion innovation. This is not just a small upgrade, it is a complete transformation. Traditional lithium-ion batteries include flammable liquids that can turn a crash or malfunction into a major fire. Tesla's aluminum-ion prototypes use solid-state polymers combined with aluminum salt, a much more stable and safer chemistry. Tests have shown these new cells remain stable beyond 572 degrees Fahrenheit. That is more than three times the safety buffer compared to traditional lithium cells. Here is what makes this truly different. When lithium batteries are damaged, they release oxygen from the cathode, which can fuel a fire. But aluminum ion cells from Tesla do not release oxygen even during failure. Instead of feeding a fire, they actually stop it from growing. It is like the difference between tossing gasoline on flames versus covering it with sand. In nail penetration tests, which are designed to simulate physical damage to a battery, Tesla's aluminum ion cells only rose in temperature by 5 degrees Fahrenheit. By contrast, lithium cells explode to over 600 degrees. That difference could be the reason a fire does or does not break out. Let us take a moment to hear from you. Would you feel more secure parking a Tesla in your garage if you knew its battery stayed safe even beyond 572 degrees Fahrenheit? Leave a comment below with the words, Tesla win, if you believe this breakthrough really matters. Tesla is also building layers of safety beyond just chemistry. Each module is equipped with thermal microfuses. If the temperature hits 176 degrees Fahrenheit, the microfuse cuts off the cell instantly. The battery casing is wrapped in a ceramic fiber material rated for 2000 degrees. Even better, Tesla's cooling system automatically shuts off heat transfer from one part of the battery to another if something goes wrong. That kind of smart engineering ensures that one bad cell cannot take the whole system down. This innovation is already changing city policies. Cities that previously banned lithium storage are starting to allow aluminum-ion-based installations. Tesla has submitted these new designs to fire safety and building departments in California, Massachusetts, and New York. 
early reports list the aluminum ion batteries as non-hazardous. This opens up basements, garages, and apartments that previously could not have energy storage units. Even insurance companies are now discussing discounts for homeowners who choose Tesla's aluminum ion packs. Back in late 2024, at Tesla's lab in Sparks, Nevada, they put these new cells through extreme trials. They exposed them to 500 degrees Fahrenheit for 20 minutes straight. What happened? No fire. No smoke. Nothing toxic. Even in a short circuit test, the temperature only rose to 140 degrees before the system shut off the bad cell. And in the brutal battery crush test that usually ends in an explosion with regular batteries, Tesla's aluminum ion packs passed without fire. Would you finally trust keeping a Tesla in your garage knowing this kind of safety is built in? Comment, aluminum ion battery, below if you think this changes everything about electric vehicle safety. This brings us to the future of clean energy that families can trust. Tesla's aluminum ion battery could finally fix the impossible trade-off. Until now, people had to choose between environmental responsibility and personal safety. Many parents parked their electric cars outside, not because they did not believe in saving the planet, but because they were worried about fires near their children's bedrooms. Tesla is removing that fear. This battery is not just a prototype. It has passed tests, completed safety reviews, and is heading for real-world certification. This is not hype, it is happening. Now let us explore something even deeper, what happens when the battery reaches the end of its automotive life? Tesla has faced criticism over battery waste, and with good reason. Today's lithium packs are often glued together so tightly they cannot be taken apart. One failed module turns the whole thing into hazardous waste. The Environmental Protection Agency reported in 2023 that only 5% of lithium-ion battery packs are fully recycled in America. That is a disaster. Most packs are shredded and burned to separate the metals, which is dangerous, expensive, and wasteful. It costs up to $4,000 per ton, and a large part of the material is sent to China for final recycling. That is not what we should call sustainable. Tesla's new aluminum ion design takes a completely new approach. No more glue. Instead, the battery modules are held together with bolts. Tesla designed it this way so machines can take it apart quickly. Cooling systems and power connections lift out in single pieces. That means the cells can be reused or replaced without destroying the entire pack. In late 2024, Tesla showed that one of these packs could be completely disassembled in under 18 minutes, by machine. Now think about this. What if you could sell back your old battery pack instead of paying to dispose of it? What if your battery could live a second life in your house after it retires from your car? Comment, modular design, if you believe this approach finally solves the electric vehicle waste problem. There is another huge benefit, aluminum itself. Unlike rare metals, aluminum is everywhere and already has a well-developed recycling system in the United States. According to the Aluminum Association, 75% of all aluminum ever made is still being used today. Recycling aluminum saves over 90% of the energy compared to making it from raw materials. One pound of new aluminum requires over 14 kilowatt hours of energy, while recycled aluminum only uses a fraction of that. Tesla's Nevada Pilot line is recovering 98% of aluminum from old battery electrodes. That means if Tesla recycles 100,000 battery packs, they get enough aluminum back to build battery housings and car bodies for 80,000 new vehicles. No new mining needed. This recycling system is made possible by a company called Redwood Materials, started by Tesla's former chief technology officer. Redwood is set to process 60,000 metric tons every year by 2026. They do not burn or shred, they use chemical processes that recover 95% of aluminum, over 90% of copper, and more than 85% of lithium. And the cost is 40% lower than recycling lithium-ion cells. Tesla is not just thinking about the end of the battery's life, they are also thinking about what comes next. Once the pack drops to 80% of its original strength, it is no longer good for a car. 
but it is still very useful for storing energy in your home. A single battery from a retired Tesla Model 2 can power a house for two to three years. Tesla has even filed patents to turn old car batteries into backup power units with very few changes. And here is the exciting part, aluminum ion cells degrade more slowly and produce less heat than older battery types. So their second life is much longer. A battery could power your car for 15 years, then your home for 5 more, and only then be recycled into new raw materials. That is a 20-year cycle that finally makes clean energy practical and cost-effective. Can you imagine saving money on a home backup system just because your old car battery still works? Comment, Tesla did it, if you believe this proves that Tesla is ahead of everyone else. This is not just a new product. It is a complete system where today's electric vehicle becomes tomorrow's power supply and next year's raw material. This is what the green revolution was supposed to be, technology that gets better, cleaner, and more affordable over time. Tesla's aluminum ion breakthrough is not just good for the environment. It is better across the entire battery life, from factory to garage to recycling plant. So ask yourself, would you rather be part of the solution or still dealing with outdated technology when this shift changes the world? What Tesla is building is not just a new kind of car. It is a new way of thinking about energy, safety, and sustainability. If you are as amazed as we are, comment the word, shocking, right now. And stay tuned, because we will soon dive even deeper into Tesla's hidden energy network and how they could outpace every other competitor before they even catch on. Thanks for watching Amp Drive, stay curious, and we will see you next time.